Hey guys, how's it going? Kripan here. So today, some pretty cool stuff happened. I was just streaming, I was checking out who else was streaming and talking about some stuff, and it turned out one of the people that I, in some ways, I actually admired, I uh, really respected at the very least, uh, out of the YouTube community from many, many years ago, started streaming and playing Hearthstone for the first time ever after basically never even seeing the game before, and it was Mr. Chocolate Rain himself, Tay Zonde, and I know some of you guys probably have no clue who that is, and those that do are probably, you know, somewhat amused. And it, it's it's someone who um, pretty much like is old school on YouTube. He had one of the first viral videos that I remember seeing. I really liked it. I even have some Tay Zonde music in uh, my uh, my music library. I think I think he has some really cool stuff, and it's it was really cool to see. Uh, the level of production um, back then. This is like seven years ago that the guy could produce. So I was impressed. I thought it was awesome. And, you know, a lot, a lot of people thought it was awesome. That's why, you know, there's quite a, quite a good following that he had. And, um, you know, he even, he even made it on, on South Park. You know, that's, that's how you know you made it, guys. When you're on South Park, you, you've done something. Yeah, whether it's good or bad, I don't know. But you've done something that people recognize. So I think it's for the good in this case. Anyway. So I decided, you know, seeing as it's his first time ever playing the game and he had no cards and nothing, I thought I would um, introduce him to the Hearthstone and Hearthstone streaming community by crushing his spirit and playing my most ridiculously overpowered deck and uh, seeing that he had absolutely no chance and then having him, you know, be miserable. Okay, we didn't actually do that, not exactly. Um, but, you know, I thought it'd be pretty fun to play against him, so uh, some kind of trades between Twitch chat later, we ended up uh, facing off, and, uh, you know, it was kind of a cool thing. Um, you know, I'm going to show you guys uh, the game, show you guys most of the footage here, and if you're expecting excellent Hearthstone play, new meta changing decks, that, this is not that video, okay? It's a for fun video, and it... If, if you're going to take something away from it, if you don't give a shit who Tay Zande is, which I know is the case for a lot of you guys, watch the video and think about how it was the first time that you played Hearthstone. You know, I have some early footage of when I played Hearthstone, and, you know, for me, it took about a week to get used to it. I played all the basic decks just to kind of understand the mechanics and memorize the cards and start expecting moves from my opponents rather than just playing a reactionary game. So, but... When you first pick up the game for the first time and you knew absolutely nothing about it, you got to back up many different times. And, uh, well, it's, uh, it's a very interesting experience. And it's a very interesting experience being on the receiving end of that. Because, yeah, I, I play a lot of Hearthstone. I play Arena. I play Constructed. And sometimes my opponent is terrible or that kind of stuff. And I, you know, I'd say this and that. Probably shouldn't. But in any case, I do. But that's still... You know, this is on a different level than that, let's say. So, imagine yourselves in his shoes, first time playing ever, and, uh, well, I made some pretty cool, uh, some pretty cool card choices to uh, play against him, so I think you guys will respect that, and I hope you guys enjoy the footage, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. If we get, like, one of those disgusting hands, it'll be, like, one of those ridiculous wake-up calls to Hearthstone. But if we get a shitty hand, we'll actually lose. So, I think... I think it's pretty fair. No, I, I could actually lose with this deck, because... Like, it's so fucking slow. And it doesn't have many things to actually play on the board most of the time. Okay, we're gonna need that card. Should we keep Ancestor's Call? Maybe. Nah, Belcher's will try hard. There you go. We'll keep it fun. Let him win? If I let him win, it's no fun. I played a deck that I could legitimately lose with. Okay. No mercy. He didn't know you could mulligan? Oh. Oh shit, I'm stream sniping him. Okay, okay. Um, I paused the stream, guys. It's fine. <laughs> See, like, I have, I have no answer for the river croc. It's going to go unchallenged. Show him no mercy. Yeah, we'll see. 
Oh man. That sets up a decent lightning storm for me, actually. But do I want to use it this early? Mm. If I lightning storm, my next play will have to be on turn 5. Well, one more thing I could do is... I could play the Shredder with a coin, and then Ancestor's Call next turn. Let's try to do that. Okay, now we're like in unfair territory. Yeah, there's there's no way you can win from this point on. I thought I thought I, I legitimately thought I had a chance to lose. Because um like he just played a bunch of early game shit and I and I couldn't come back from it. I just died of damage. Alright. So let's let's make a fun deck here. Goblin for chicken. Oh! Yeah. Alright. Alright. This is good. This is good. We can go places with this. Oh man, a coin play. Is that a novice? A novice engineer? I bet it's a novice engineer. I hope you like my invention. All right. Is there a Merle? Oh. All right. What? Be a five-five chicken. Oh my god! This game is cruel to him. Oh god! <laughs> this isn't happening. <laughs> buff oh my god I'm evil this is gonna be the greatest game ever This is worse than last game. <laughs> oh man. I think, I think we need some coaching.
Try, try one more, one more, one more. Like, to be fair, I had a really, really, really good draw. He called you a big bully. I'm playing a fucking angry chicken deck, and the only card that ho Hobgoblin hits is angry chicken. And then I drew both Hobgoblins and both angry chickens. Oh, here we go. Alright, let's have a lot of fun. Let's have a lot of fun. Oh god. <laughs> okay. I don't want to coin it out though. I want to like give him a coin so I can get back a coin. Right? That's the way to do it? Oh no, not this again. Oh my god, he's gonna kill my little walker Cho. I guess I gotta try it. The correct play here would be to leave it on the board and just play a creature. And then kill it later with that creature. Oh my god, fun ruiner. No! Okay. Okay, we're good. We're good. You're yeah, good boys. Give me an arcane missiles here. No. Alright. That's fine. We saved it. <laughs> no! No! Oh, man. What? Is that a fireball? Oh god. Alright, I guess. Oh yeah, turtle time. My turtle's shiny now because of shiny mind games. It's snapping. Look at that. <laughs> yeah, I'm getting bursted, guys. Don't sacrifice your raptor into the turtle. Don't sacrifice the raptor. I swear he's gonna sacrifice the raptor. God damn it! How could I lose? I don't know. I'm trying, guys. I'm really trying. Yeah, obviously the best play here is to shatter the sun and velons and kill that thing, but... Let's do this instead. Damn it. Okay, that went in our favor again. I've just cast Confusion. Okay, here we go. We got a big creature on the board. Well, not attacking was technically the worst play. Okay. Let's rock hard. We got Merlux. Yeah, killing one of the five fives is the play here. I actually mill myself if Pagel draws. Just just to show him a few concepts of the game, you know? Murloc combo. An auto completion deck would probably be better than this one. Whoa, that's a good play! Alright. Oh. Yeah. I hope he got some chickens. Ah, shit, I'm gonna mill myself now. No! Oh man, that was such a sick chicken! Fuck you, Pagel. Alright, what do you have? Oh my god. Alright, let's play some shit. There we go. Shitty turn. We gotta save all the buffs for the chicken, guys. Please make a chicken deck for ranked. I don't know, I think I'd 
I think I'd rather just play Minesweeper. Oh, fuck. Oh, I should have played that first then. Okay. Alright, Piggle, you can draw me a card here. Fine. Oh, what? I didn't play it there. Alright, fine. Don't kill the hobgoblin. Alright, fine. That won't work, though. You have to play it. The thing just summons them. That's gonna confuse the shit out of him. That's gonna work, though. Alright, he's got a chicken. So... <laughs> I... I, I chode him my thought steal and he thought stole my combo. God damn! That's beginner's luck for you, man. That, that chicken is a threat. I gotta get that bling trun out. But I don't wanna play hobgoblin without like the other chicken. I'm gonna make him think chicken is a top tier card. Yeah, all the pros are playing it, man. Holy fucking murlocs. Alright. That's actually pretty scary. Did he get gladiators? Oh my god. Uh, okay, well, we have to deal with the chicken. Maybe it's actually best that I balance the murloc. He has lethal. Oh, come on. He's already fireballed twice. That's yeah, fine. That's fine. We'll have we'll have a big turn next turn. I got I got my combo, guys. Hobgoblin, Captain's Parrot, Greenskin. Sick. Pyroblast. Is he like setting up an arcane explosion here? Right. Nope, no weapon attack. Alright, how do we play this? We gotta kill that. So we probably have to Velen's that. What does he have? Crocodile. Pretty good. Okay. 
Oh my god. There we go. The disaster. I mean, he only needs three damage. I think I'm dead to a wolf rider. I don't think the deck has frostbolt, but it has wolf rider. Oh man. If he pings me, I'm still in Wolf Rider range. Okay, we're we're out of Wolf Rider range. Thankfully. Oh man, the massacre begins. I don't, I don't think he has far like he can win I don't think he's played wolf rider I think he can top deck wolf rider and then top deck wolf rider again or arcane intellect into double wolf rider if he pings face he can arcane intellect into double wolf rider still no Try this deck in ranked. This deck would get destroyed in ranked, dude. Absolutely murdered. I gave him another chance, guys. Oh, snap. 